this area you have to knock everyone out first all first and foremost by the way um, if you don't you will alert pretty much everyone in the area when the bomb goes off there's no way getting around up blowing up the door And you sleep. Loot. Thank you. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event Thank and approved dignitaries only. Nothing, nothing. Alrighty then. I think up here. All right, now you can open that door if you want to. <coughs> I'm not going to. I'm gonna keep that door closed. Technically, it's a lot easier going through that doorway, but I'm not going to. I like doing it this way. Come on, there we are. <coughs> Excuse me. There are two enemies in this room. We have to be cautious on who we kill, so or who we uh, knock out, I should say, <coughs> and how we knock them out. Thank you. Now we're going to move him somewhere where we don't have to worry about him dying. Be cautious when you are disp uh, disposing of bodies, by the way, because if you accidentally throw them or... If you throw them too far, or against something, there's a possibility of them you cracking their heads open and killing them. Aw, oh, they look so comfortable. Okay. So don't have to worry about any more enemies in here, because they're all unconscious. Um, if you did come through the door and you want to close it, or you want to open it again for some reason, here's the door to open it. Or close it, depending on whichever you did. Good so far. And that. Nothing. Alright, let's save before we place that bomb. <coughs> now, whatever you do, after you. Oh, excuse me. That came out of nowhere. After you blow the door, do not run forward or to the right to um, get out of here. You want to go to the left and stay crouching the entire time. <laughs> there it goes. There are enemies to your right that'll start. That'll notice you if you take too long, or <laughs> if you go to the front or right. So just swim through to the left. Here. Come on, get out of the water. No, don't swim down, Corvo. Stay crouching. You can see them over there. And we made it through. They didn't see us. And that's how you break out Cold Ridge Prison without being seen. <coughs> it's a bit annoying to do, but it gets the job done. <coughs> Let 
Dunwall Sewers, Fugitive. You've escaped Coldridge Prison with the help of hidden allies. If you reach the Waverin uh, River, they promise to aid you in your next move. Continue. Don't worry about being seen at this point, you're good. Can I jump over it? I can! Awesome. <coughs> Corvo, if you're reading this, that means our plan worked and you've broken free from Coldridge. One of our contacts has hidden weapons for you somewhere deeper in the sewers. Grab the gear and find Samuel, where these tunnels drop out of the river. He'll bring you to us. A friend who will meet you soon. <coughs> Right. Watch the horde of rats. Right. If we're lucky, one of them. <coughs> now, thankfully, this doesn't count towards your uh, clean hands thing because it was unavoidable, literally. This just shows you the rat mechanic of the game. They will swarm, eat, and just destroy everything in their way. So we won't get out of here before they're done eating. I don't think they'll attack you, so you don't have to really worry. At least right now, anyway. They'll attack him, though. Those rats. <coughs> uh, Amanda and I only had enough <laughs> coin to buy half the elixir we needed. Even though... Even that's all gone now. And there's nothing to do but wait. <coughs> We're very sick, and there's no place... Above to hide from the city watch, they're breaking into our house, into houses all over the, our district. We'll uh, so we'll stay here and share the last hours, our last hours together. Our fire will keep the rats away, but they'll inherit the city. Aww. And here's the corpse they're hugging as they died. It's kind of sad. <clears throat> Alrighty then. He was holding the wheel steady, so we couldn't open it. Now, normally I don't eat everything in sight, <laughs> but we're not coming back here, so it doesn't really matter. Jeez. <clears throat> Let's watch them eat the rest of the corpse. Alright. So let's feed the rest of the rats and make, move them away from there so we don't have to worry about them. <clears throat> if you're not careful enough, they will swarm you. There we are. For the murder of our fair empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne. No one will keep us from death. You cannot kill the rat plague. Must be delivered to the city watch at once. Don't know what that says. Alright, let's go up here first. Alright, I'm going to show you two ways to deal with uh, tripwires. First, the Ball Street way. Take a bottle, find a tripwire, throw the bottle at the tripwire. <clears throat> the second way is a tripwire out that bottom of that stairway. Is to come here, find the uh, disarmor that has the trap, or find the projectile, disarm it. Very simple way, uh, tri method to do it. Anyway, the Ball Street joke comes from this. Um, when I first played this game, Kisei was watching it with me. <laughs> and <laughs> we're just like, Ball Street? Where's Bottle Street? Why do you name a street Bottle Street? And we saw the bottles, and we're like, Ball Street, motherfucker. And we start throwing bottles. So you'll see me do that quite often. <laughs>
Okay, what we got here? Corpse. Nothing down there. Somehow the strip wire always tripped. That's odd. You get um incendiary rounds from those uh traps if you ouch. If you uh disable them without tripping the wire. Alright. <clears throat> Greetings, Corvo, or should I say Lord Protector, as you were known before the title was wrongfully taken from you. You are servants of the Empire and the true Empress, a group of loyalists who want very much to meet you. Take these weapons crafted for you of our finest materials in the aisle. And meet with our man Samuel near the near where the tunnel splits into the Wavering River. All haste and luck, we share a common purpose. <coughs> I love his weapon. That's about the wheel, don't worry about that. The crossbow is our silent weapon. <laughs> Alright. The wheel, as it mentioned, is if you press the L2 button, you'll hold the L2 button, you'll get this up. Um, if you go to, like, say, crossbow, let's go actually with something we don't have. No, we got the incendiary bolts, okay. Sleeping darts, that's a good one. <laughs> if you hover, if you, um, hover over like this and press a direction button, it'll be a quick equip. All I have to do is press L2, or I have to press the button on your D-pad and it'll automatically equip to that. <laughs> so if I want, I now have explosive rounds. Sleeping rounds. And regular bolts. <laughs> and then, my gun. I love his switchblade, though. <laughs> Alright, now it's going to teach us about sliding. Press circle while sprinting to slide. Slide. <clears throat> Jelly, in case you, you're too daft to remember, look for your whiskey to remember. Whiskey, got it? If you I want your share, you'll sort it out. If not, I'll come look back for it next month. <laughs> this is the first of uh, many, many saves that actually have a combination to it. The clue is actually, the answer is we're actually behind here. Ball Street. Ball Street! Alright. Enough Ball Street. Didn't break. There we go. Okay. Combination's right there. 451 if you can't read it. So we go over here. Crouch. Four, five, one. What's nice is it automatically opens for you, so you can actually spend enough time. If you spend enough time here, you can get it without having to find the combination. Alright. <clears throat> That's that. Crouch. Got the incendiary round. So apparently I was wrong about that. Shocking. Uh, you can get the incendiary round even if you hit the tripwire. Nothing in the water. Base. You know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take them out alone. But what if no one from the squad is around? Then try to make a lot of noise when you can. Knock something over if you can. Bastard. So we're gonna go for a sign take out on him. Sounds like a dead reaper in here. <coughs> Drop assassin. Assassination. Drop an enemy from above and press R1 just before landing on him to perform a drop assassination. You won't take any damage from the fall. There is a trophy for killing five people in this fashion. <clears throat> I have yet to get that trophy. If I do the high chaos run through, I'll, I'll be sure to get that. This will show you taking a piss in the sewers. All right. <coughs> Excuse me. Don't mind me while I save just one last time. Well, not one last time. I'm probably going to save once more before leaving. Stepped on the rats. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> 
if you don't hold down the R2 button, they'll actually headbutt you, so be cautious. Join your friend. I can actually hear them snoring. I love that I actually added that in there. There should only be two people left. Him and the one beneath me. If I do that, he'll see me. <clears throat> ah, wonderful. Thank you. <laughs> Coming through while I'll dispose of your unconscious body. Be careful not to dispose of the bodies too close to where people can see them, obviously. <clears throat> they may uh, see you, may see the body, or they may hear you dropping the body, so be cautious. My rule of thumb is if you think it's too close, it's probably too close. And that's the last of the people in this area. Alright. So let's find some stuff. Thank you. Alright, so far we've gotten two of the optional things we can do in this area. Or one of the optional things we can do in this area, and that was uh, the jellies safe. The second thing we can do, that's hidden, is jump over this over here and down here reading this note will activate the second hidden thing uh, let's see here it's here by the wave written <clears throat> I'll make my last home it stinks to the void but my grandmom's hog uh, hagfish stew will drive the, that order away I remember sailing out to the, on this river to the great ocean that vast blinding light and blue water I was a tender 15, and our nets were always full of, bu uh, full to bursting. The old days before everything went to shit. Anyway, g anyway goes, it's either the, uh, it's either the boots of the watch against my skull, the teeth of the rats on my bones, or the trembling of the plague all over my skin. Matters none to me. None to me. Don't matter none to me. Some guy found his way here and died, sadly. Another way to get in here is simple as just this. Just go up to it and break it. Of course, you may want to do that when everyone's unconscious or dead. That way, you don't alert anyone. But up here is some hidden stuff. <clears throat> Alright. It is entirely possible to sneak through that entire area without being seen. Or knock anyone unconscious. I've done it before. Attention gun wall citizens. Here's Adam Corvo, responsible for the murder of our fair Empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne, has temporarily escaped state custody. Any evidence as to his whereabouts must be delivered All right, to the watch at once. Corvo, over here. <coughs> Quickly, I'm a friend. Before we do that, there's actually the final thing you can do here. The side objective is a chest hidden in this water over in this area. Uh, be cautious because there are creatures here that will eat you. There's one. Now, where is that chest? There it is. That was a good view of that uh, whale I was telling you about. <laughs> I'm Samuel. 
and I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. They said you'd come out here. I could still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. It's just down the river from here. And that's that. Alright, so let's see here. <clears throat> Didn't kill anyone. Never saw, seen. Uh, let's see here. Dead or unconscious bodies found, too. Oh, okay. I was wondering if that uh, dead or unconscious body found thing affected the uh, ghost, but apparently it doesn't. <laughs> so, so long as I don't kill anyone, um, or get seen, I'll be fine. So, let's see here. Hostiles killed, zero. Civilians killed, zero. Alarms rung, zero. <laughs> nice. Excuse me, I also did the, uh, sp the bus actions. Obviously no runes, bone charms, that's our shrine, uh, uh, Sokolov's paintings. And I got almost all of the coins. So, that's good in my book. I'll continue, and after the cutscene, that'll be in the end of this set. <coughs> Actually, went in here, because now I can, uh, I forgot about this. Anyway, um, if you guys like the Designer LP, please feel free to like and subscribe. You can check out more stuff on my channel for more interesting LPs. So, see you guys next time. Bye.